Hello, my name is Dr Hibbert and I'm a GP and the clinical lead for diabetes in Newham. Thank you to all our key workers who've kept our borough going during this pandemic and to all of you who have been stringently socially distancing to help reduce the transmission of coronavirus. Whether you've been recently diagnosed or have been living with diabetes for many years, now is the time to be intentional about your health, to dust off that fitness tracker and start monitoring your steps each day, to take your medication as prescribed, and to make those small changes in your diet, eating more vegetables and fruit instead of salty, sugary or fatty snacks. A little progress each day adds up to big results. The Newham Diabetes Service is here to support you. Please contact us if you need us. We've adapted our services to make sure we can provide advice, guidance and support safely and effectively. So we encourage you to continue with your reviews, even though they may be virtual and to attend any appointments you are invited to. We know many people are staying away from health services at the moment, and this worries us. This could put your health at risk. Please do not hesitate or, and allow your health to deteriorate before contacting a health professional. We can speak to you on the telephone, arrange a video call, or if necessary, a face-to-face -face appointment in the appropriate PPE. For people who live with diabetes daily, you know the symptoms and signs we need you to monitor. We rely on you to get in touch with us when you need us, sooner rather than later. Whether you need support with your physical or mental health, there are options for you. For anyone with symptoms of coronavirus, there is advice and guidance on a variety of websites, including Diabetes UK, NHS.UK and Gov.UK. There is is advice about arranging a test for coronavirus, what to do if you've been contacted to self-isolate. There is advice about social distancing, returning to work and how your employer can support you. There is advice about managing your medication as well as the vital sick day rules. However, Please remember, if your symptoms worsen, contact 111 or attend A&E, just as you would have done before the pandemic. This is for any emergency or urgent treatment. Please do not sit at home with chest pain, a swollen leg, abdominal pain that's worsening. It's important to get help promptly. For any other health related issues or concerns about your diabetes, please contact your GP surgery or your diabetes specialist team. Again, we are here to support you through this period of uncertainty and beyond. Please remember the importance of checking your feet daily and contacting your GP surgery or foot health clinic if you notice any new wounds or ulcers or cuts on your feet. Any changes, contact us. If you've been asked to monitor your blood sugars and your blood pressure, please keep a note of the readings so that you can discuss them at your next review appointment. We're all facing real difficulties at the moment. 
we're having to work so differently, stay at home, not be able to go out and have a good time with our friends and family. And we've all made tremendous sacrifices. Coronavirus is here and we have limited knowledge about how, what is, the future is going to look like. But we are planning and we are hoping that we can provide a service that is beneficial to you. But we need your support in that, whether that be in advising us how you think we should be continuing with the service or following the government guidelines around social distancing. I know it's really tempting to want to go out and to meet all our friends and family, but at the moment that's quite difficult and it isn't necessarily the best thing for us as a group. So my ask is to follow the rules about staying at home when you can, but when you do go out, to remember to wash your hands, to adhere by the guidance that the government has given us so that we can get through this together.